Welcome back everybody, this is Danny Code, and we're continuing on with the Avorian playthrough on Hardcore Mode. And we are getting very close to breaching the barrier. We have 7 out of 8 Zotan artifacts that we need. And in this episode what I'd like to do is I'd like to... Oop, hey, <laughs> all over the place. What I'd like to do is concentrate on getting that last Zotan artifact, and that is the, the one that you get through the artifact delivery mission. And... To find and start that artifact delivery mission, it is found on bulletin boards near the barrier itself. So we're going to go ahead and find that and do that mission in this episode. And what I'd also like to do in this episode is get ready for breaching the barrier by either building some new ships or bringing some new sh bringing some of my uh, ships here because most of them are idle and absolutely doing nothing. I should actually, and I've been slacking here, <laughs> should actually have these guys all mining and kind of following me along uh, in, in the galaxy, kind of near me, but I kind of left them behind and I kind of stopped paying attention to them, but either I can build some new ones, about seven new ones, or I can bring these guys a little bit closer to the barrier. Alternately, what I can do is I can find some ships to board and take over and uh and just have them ready to, to when i want to breach the barrier anyways so with that said what i want to do let me look at the map real quick here so the barrier i think is yeah so here's the barrier right here right so i'm thinking anywhere along here we're going to find the mission. What is this? Oh, distress signal. Anywhere around here, we'll find the mission on a bulletin board. So I want to do that. I also want to be on the lookout for the the special sector that have the eight asteroids that will allow you to open up a wormhole to breach the barrier as well. So. Yeah, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to look for that mission. So I will be on the lookout for that mission. I'm going to pull my guys in here, and I will jump around looking for it, and I'll be right back. Oh, well, there it is. So I didn't even have to go anywhere. So this was found in the same sector that I was in, and we have looking for Zotan artifacts. So there we go. So let us um, go ahead and accept that. And uh, yeah, it's a new mission. So let's go look at that real quick in the mission objectives here. So artifact delivery. And some people who call themselves the Brotherhood have posted bulletins and are looking for Zotan artifacts. They, they seem to pay high reward to some people who bring them artifacts. So, okay. So uh, let's go ahead and show location. So that is out here. Where are we? We're up here. So that shouldn't be too hard to get to, although we do have to get around this. Um, but I don't see it being too difficult. So yeah, so, okay. So I will jump there and I'll be right back. All right, so we're here. Oh, so looks like we have a fight. No, so there's just some pirates here, okay. So that's kind of weird. What else do we have here? Huh. Okay, so let's just take care of these guys. I am in the right spot, right? Yeah, artifact delivery. Okay. So these guys shouldn't be too hard, I don't think. So let's torpedo some of these guys. I think. Let's get this. Uh, let's get this done quicker. <laughs> That's the one. That's what I like. <laughs> All right. And next, what do we got next year? How about you? So, and he is definitely the last one. Yes. Oh no, we got. <laughs> we got reinforcements. All right, so. Sorry. 
let's concentrate on this guy. Yeah, so now they're taking now they're taking me down a little bit. That's okay. We will Yeah, didn't think those would work. Send out our fighters, I think. Let's try to get this guy out of the way, because I am tired of him lobbing his damn torpedoes at me. here. I've got three left, so I should be okay. A little worried there for a minute. Ah, got them both. <laughs> Try to get a little bit, a little bit closer to him, so there we go. Ah, oh, got them both. Jerk. Alright, well, it's gonna have to get him with conventional weapons here and our fighters. I think we're out of the woods, though, so I think we're good there he is almost dead thankfully there we go very good who is oh got got more uh, as long as they don't send in any more reinforcements I think this is like the second batch of reinforcements here go. Got him. This guy doesn't seem to be... Hmm. Send some torpedoes his way. He doesn't have any shields. That's nice. Love it. Much better. As long as no one... Um, any more reinforcements come. We should be good. Nice. Okay. Next. Don't think that's a good idea. Yeah, I didn't think that was a good idea. Doesn't hurt to... Well, it hurt to try. <laughs> it, it didn't... Now I know, though. So, that's good. Fine. Alright, so let's just pound on this guy, I guess. Uh, more reinforcements. Okay, so strategy number two. What we're going to do is we're just going to get out of here. I'm not going to worry about my fighters. I can always get more of those. By the way, what I want to do, so we don't make too many here, let's just make sure that we're... Oops, that's not what I wanted. There we go. Okay. So we're not continually... continually we're not making them. <laughs> okay, so what I want to do, let's zoom out here. Where was that beacon? There's that beacon. Alright, so let's just get to this beacon and see what it says. Because they just keep on sending in reinforcements. And I ain't all about that. There we go. Interact. Scanners online. Active. Scanning. Continue. Success. Calling the collector. Please be patient. Extraction will begin soon. I can't believe it. Our bulletin actually works. I have your artifacts. Yes, we know. He will now give it to us. Here, have it. <laughs> and we don't want any witnesses or competition. Okay, so we gotta fight with these guys now. Alright. So does that... Alright. So let us... Let me see. So Shield Breaker is one of them. So let's try to get these guys out of the way. 
So he has point defense. Well, hardcore mode is definitely living up to its definitely living up to its name. So, we got that going on. All right, so let's concentrate fire on this guy. This guy here. Get him out of the way. There we go. Much better. So it looks like the other guys are beating on him too. Well, that's pretty cool. So the, those pirates and those marauders are beating on him too. So this is the last guy. No, we still have one more. Okay. So very cool. All right. So which is the next one? Oh yeah. So I, I see it there. Okay. So this guy. He is okay. So he it looks like the other guys are taking care of that one. So the hull breaker. So we'll take care of this one. There we go. So this is the last one. So he should drop the Zotan artifact, I think. So that definitely makes it uh, definitely makes it easier. And this guy's a tank, so he probably has pretty good hull, I would assume. And he has point defense, so. Just gonna concentrate fire on him, and it, yeah, look at, so that's interesting. So if there's other pirates or marauders, they will take care of them too. So that's actually a help. So that's kind of neat, I like that. I mean, they're also hitting me still, I think, but they're also concentrating on them as well. So, so yeah, I don't know if that's a, uh, a bug. <laughs> if they all should be concentrating on me and, and not paying attention to the Brotherhood or the Four. Interesting, though. I am not complaining at this point in time. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get that Zotan artifact on the drop, and then I will... Uh, I will hightail it out of here because they keep on did they no well no more reinforcements yet so maybe i can take care of those guys too so yeah we'll try to take care of those guys too in the, you know after we take care of the brotherhood here um did i concentrate fire on him i don't know if i did it definitely helps if i do there we go tempted to throw another Salvo to it. There we go. Whatever. One got through. Did one get through? No, both didn't. <laughs> oh, it looks like we have some Zotan coming in as well. So I think I'm just going to gather the drop here and then get out. Mission accomplished. Artifact delivery. There we go. So with the artifact delivery, I guess you have to have. Another artifact that's not equipped, I guess, and then you will be able to just come to the waypoint here, and they will, uh, and it'll progress that mission. So, all right, so let's just take care of these guys. You know what? Why not? This one. If they if they call in reinforcements, I will be like, I'm not I'm not doing four more. But hopefully now that I killed the Brotherhood, those four guys there, then they won't call in any more reinforcements, hopefully. on him and I did get the Zotan effect and I yeah I did 
gone. Dead. Okay, next. So what do we got here? Just the one left. Alright, yay. Turn around and get this guy. Watch out for reinforcements. And I, I know the Zotan are coming as well, so. But they shouldn't be too hard, hopefully. And there shouldn't be too many of them. I'm staying around because it. I have a feeling that there's a lot of good salvage here. So I do want to clear out and then salvage what's left in the in the area here, in the sector. All right, there we go. Very cool. All right, so here we go. Actually, you know what I'm going to do? I'm just going to sit back and watch them go. So they should just leave me alone if I don't fire anything. Yeah, so they should just leave me alone. They should just pass by. Hello, guys. Ooh, uh, let's turn off my weapons. Make sure they don't do anything. <laughs> there they are. How many are them? Uh, one, two, three, four, six, seven, so quite a few. So are they going anywhere? Or are they just standing still? Hmm. So that guy's on the move. Okay, so there they go. There they go. See you later, guys. Okay, so now I'm going to salvage all I can. And let's repair. Oh, I still need more. Uh, whatever. Okay, that's fine. That is fine. All right, so I'm just going to salvage here, guys. And uh, we will start to look for the eight special asteroids. All right, be right back. Oh, well, there's a, uh, <laughs> there's a new kind of tutorial thing, I guess. From Bao Bao Xiet, whatever, the adventurer. So once you have all eight artifacts, apparently this guy comes around. So hey there, you found all eight artifacts. Good job. Thanks. It should be possible to get over the barrier using those. Yep. As soon as you find a way, I'll catch up to you. Okay, so I guess as soon as we find the uh, the eight special asteroids, so all right, so that's cool. And uh, yeah, I'm just in this sector because I wanted to. We need some resources, so instead of mining for them, I'm just gonna buy some. We should be okay. We're making enough credits. So, anyways, yep. So I'm still on the lookout for the eight special. Asteroids, so I'll be right back basically um, by the way So what I'm gonna do is I'm just going to they're they're usually kind of like in the sector like hugging The last time I found them the last couple times I found them they were in like one or two sectors away from uh, the actual Barrier, so I'm just gonna kind of jump around here and see what we get All right, so I'll be right back Ooh, Okay, so we found them <laughs> All right, so here are the eight asteroids that we need to put a ship near with each of the Zotan artifacts. So it should be, let me see here, we got, oh, this is number two, that's number one. So one, two, this one should be number three. Yeah, okay, so Let's go ahead and start making chips. So now that we know where, where that is, it's right over here. So let's go ahead and mark that. And tag sector. Oops, no, that's not what I want to do. I want to... There we go. So what do you want? Uh... Special asteroids. There we go. Good enough. 
good enough. Now, what I do need to look for now is a shipyard. And what's the closest one here? So I'm not really sure what's in here. Yeah, so these, okay. So we do know the contents of these. All right, so we're just gonna go down here to this shipyard here. All right, so let's go, oh, that's really not too much in here. <laughs> let's go to the shipyard and talk to them. We're gonna build ship and all I wanna do is I want to build a single block for now. I think we should be okay. So let me see how many we can do. So let's add crew. Probably don't need to add crew, but we'll add crew anyways. And we'll just call this uh, B ship 01. And we're gonna make it out of, instead of iron, let's just make it out of trinium. Okay. And you can see there's a cost to making these. So this goes up every time. And if it goes into the Ogonite range, then I won't be able to make any. So let's just make a couple here. We may need to bring our other ships in from the outskirts of the galaxy, but uh, yeah, so let's see what we can do here. So there's one, let's go ahead and, I think they can do two at a time. So build another one, same exact way. All right, so we're gonna wait for those. Well, I gotta protect my little guys. I got pirates and Zotan coming in here. <laughs> just super awesome. That's all right. They should be they should be fine. They're they're really small, probably really hard targets to actually hit. But uh, let's dispatch these guys as quick as we can. Yeah, they don't look too tough. They should be good. And they're not too close to the guys, uh, the, the little board cubes that we got going on there. So we should be all right. All right, well, we just got one more guy to go here. But that yeah, wasn't too tough of a battle. They, they damaged my shields just a little bit. But that is okie dokie, not that big a deal. So let's just get this guy real quick. I don't know what he's doing out here, but I don't want him to get to my little Borg pods, my Borg pods. <laughs> Why? Oh, he's just way out there. I don't, even really, I don't even know if I want to worry about that. Well, yeah, let's go get him. What the heck? We're speedy. We can catch up to him pretty quick. Who is he chasing? He's chasing a, he's chasing that destroyer. Okay. Or they're duking it out out here. Yeah, he's his shields are down, so that's good. Do a little end run around him. Shouldn't take us long to take this guy down. Do I want to throw his tor torpedoes at him? I don't think I have a lot of torpedoes left, do I? Oh, I have very little left. <laughs> what are these? Uh, whatever. There we go. All right. So let's go back and deal with our guys. So let's say one, two, three, four, five, six. So we'd still need that one more. So let's go to the shipyard. And while we're going towards it, let's have them build a ship as well. So that'll be our seven. And everything good? Yeah, so let's just go ahead and build. Oh, see the Ogonite. So there we go. So I can't build that one. So I need some Ogonite. So I, but I do have a ship elsewhere that I will warp in or warp in. 
that I'll have jump into here, into this section. Alright, so I have this ship, and let's get this guy into into uh, working order here, and then we will warp him into, warp him, we'll jump him into the uh, the next sector there that we need him in. So let's go ahead and build, and what do we got here? So he needs engines, thrusters, and uh, that should be it. So let's just throw some engines on him. And what do we have here? So let's just make him out of titanium for now. And we'll just do this. Let's go ahead and mirror like so. And we'll just put a group of engines on like this. Something like that should be fine, I think, maybe. And then let's go ahead and just go ahead and throw on something like this. I know it'll look silly, but that's fine. Alternately, I'd like to go ahead and put on some gyro rays, but this should do it for now. I think we need energy, don't we? Yeah, we definitely need... <laughs> yeah, we're not generating any energy. So what I'm going to do is just on the front here, I'm going to tack on some generators. Just like... So. And that should get us some generators. That should have now enough energy. I think. Yep. Definitely more energy more energy than we need that's for sure we definitely need some crew and my acceleration is still low so what i'm gonna do let's go ahead and just put on another set there and that should be fine it's probably low because i don't have any crew so there's that all right very space odyssey 2001 this ship <laughs> All right, let's go get some crew. And who is close? I guess we're just going to go here. Should be fine. All right, so let's just grab some crew. You know what? I don't know what I need. So let's go in here. So we need... Let's see here. Crew stats. There we go. So not too many. Four and two there. All right. So, get out of that, dock, hire crew, and we'll just get, we have tons of room, so we'll just get a bunch of crew here, and it looks like we need some vanilla crew as well, and there's that, so let me make sure that we are Okay, so they should leave us alone because we don't have any turrets on us. So let's go ahead and look at... Oh yeah, so auto sign. So auto sign is fine. Alright, so they should leave us alone and now we're definitely... Yeah, we're cruising along there. Cool. Alright, so let's go ahead and... I also want to... Let me see if we can't just stick on some... Do we have any hyperspace upgrades? Hopefully. If not, we can put on some, here's one here. Yeah. So if not, we can put on some hyperspace blocks. Okay, so let's, let's, let's see what that gets us there. Yeah, so that should be good enough because we're just going up here. All right, so let us jump up there. All right, so we are here with our other ships and we have this ship. I'm probably not going to do too much to this ship. We'll just leave this as is. But I do want to be close to the shipping yard here with my other guys. All right, so the thing is now I need to design some just simple ship that will do the job and then use that as a template for the other guys here. So. Let's go ahead and go into this Borg cube and then 
go into the design and again I just want to make it functional so I'm going to throw on some just kind of like I did with the other guy there we'll throw on some engines here actually let's try that try to do a better job there yeah we'll do that I like it <laughs> we will put on some thrusters as well Let's go ahead and make it a little pleasing. And then do this and that, just like that. Sure, looks good to me. Okay, so there's that, there's that. And I think that's really, we don't need too much. We do need energy generation, so got that. Let's go ahead and put, let's just do this. So, looks good to me, and you know what? I'm just going to give it a little bit of design there. And we will do this. Rotate. And make it smaller, like so. Something like that. Actually, no, that's stupid. <laughs> that's real dumb let's go ahead and do this there we go yeah it looks real stupid um, I'm going to go ahead and do this as well like that and then I don't want to put too much weight on it I'm just it just it just looks horrible and I just want to do a little something here yeah sure <laughs> it looks or, it's fine it's fine all right so what do we got here we need some crew all right so some crew I mean it's it's okay now but yeah let's just put on a few crew actually you know what I'm gonna steal crew from peacekeeper command here I think he has just quite a lot of it. One captain, and let's go ahead and just give him vanilla crew here. Okay, is that enough? Okay, there we go. So we just needed the one engineer, and we have three crewmen to spare. All right, so there's our little ship. I like it. <laughs> it's my little utility. All right, so let's go ahead and go into our other ships and do the same thing. All right, I think I have everybody set here. So the other thing now I need to do is I need to go ahead and look at my Zotian artifacts and then equip each of these with that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to Loopy Angel who has a lot of them installed. So we have to uninstall them and to do that I'm going to need to go to a equipment dock. So and there's no equipment docks here so we're going to do that. Okay so you just need to be three kilometers away from the uh, equipment dock and you can go into your systems here and then un uninstall whatever you need so okay so what do we want to keep on so let's go ahead and keep on what do we have actually let's go see what we have so we need I know we have duplicates of some of these so we have let's see one two five seven so one two five and seven so we need three so where's three here? So we need to uninstall this. And what does three do? Three does, one, two, three, three does armored turret slots. So that is probably going to take off some armored tur turret slots. 
but I'm not too worried about that. We should be fine for now, because I don't anticipate fighting too many things, so we should be okay. All right, so systems, so we got one, two, and three. And we need four. So this is four, so this is unarmed turret slots. All right, so let's definitely take that one off as well. So, okay, so one, two, three, four, five, seven. So we need six. Where's six? That's eight. And here is six. I think. I think I'm going to keep that one on. So we'll keep six on Weeping Angel. So let's take off eight here. And that's jump range, that's fine. We'll take off that one as well. And I see that mayday, but I'm not gonna not gonna deal with it right now. Alright, so we should have let's see what we got here. Let's go ahead. One, two, three, four, five, seven, and six is on Weeping Angel. Seven and eight. Okay, so there we go. So we have those off. I'm going to go ahead and jump my guys into this sector because I think there's more protection here. Yeah, so we have more destroyers here. So I'm going to bring those guys here. And let's just go ahead and do this. And this guy has a jump range, so he will just jump right in. Oh, he has no captain, so we're going to have to grab him manually. That's okay. There we go. He is on his way. Get this guy as well. Actually, I think you can in queue. I think we can select all of these, can't we? And do the same thing pretty sure yeah there we go so we can we can do a group of them which is really nice all right so everybody's on their way except this guy so let's go ahead and switch to sector and jump him manually get him in close here so we can transfer captain okay so oops no that's not what i wanted i want f there we go all right so let's go ahead and transfer one of my captains here i think i do yeah so i have two captains and this one is level two, level three. So we'll do level two here. Good. Okay. So now he has a captain on the ship. All right. So we need to jump all the way here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to, I'm going to jump peacekeeper kind of in here and see where, because I don't want to lose any of these ships. So I'm going to jump him into here. Before I do that, let's go ahead and look and see if there's any yellow blips, because I don't want to jump any of my guys into the yellow blips or into the hidden mass sectors. So let's go ahead and go into Peacekeeper, I mean, excuse me, uh, Weeping Angel Command, and then go to the map. Okay, so we have two here. So let's go ahead and start marking these because I don't want them to jump into any place that has hostiles. So let's um, tag that sector, tag that sector, and it looks like we have, and I don't think this is going to be an issue, but we'll tag that sector as well. Then let's go ahead and jump here. and make sure everything is safe. Let's go to the map. Yeah, so we have more. <laughs> we have a ton of sectors that we need to tag here. Tag this one, tag this one, tag that one, tag that one. Oops, no, tag it. Not enter coordinates, damn it. Tag it. 
Tag it. These are the places we don't want to jump into, just in case there's hostiles. Tag that sector. Tag that one. Tag this one. Tag this one. Tag these three. It's like one of those memory games. <laughs> Tag. Alright, I think we got... I think all the rest should be good. What's this? Tag that one. I almost didn't see that one. Okay, so that should give us a clear shot there. So let's go ahead and let's do these guys first. go and then we will go ahead and do our last ship here and that one only needs two jumps okay so while they're doing that let's go ahead and oops go back into the map here and I want to tag this sector or not tag it but I want to jump in myself with uh, weep, weeping angel here Okay, so while we're here, let's go ahead, while we're waiting for other guys, let's go ahead and go into utility class here, and we will put on one of the systems. So we'll just start with one with him, and then we will park him, what? What's going on? There it goes. <laughs> it wasn't on there. What's going on? Okay. And where is number one? So that is number... It's number three. Number one. Okay, so we'll park him over here near number one. And I forget how close they need to be. Let me look that up real quick. Okay, so they need to be 1.5 kilometers away from the actual asteroid. Or closer, I should say. And that should do it. I think that, you know what? I think that red light goes on when you're close enough. Hold on. So we're f further away. So yeah, I think that red, that red light goes on. Indicator light. Yeah, so there it goes. Cool. You will be number two. So, that's number three, that's number eight, wait a minute, number seven, number five, there's number two, okay. So we will park him near number two here. Whoa, slow down. <laughs> slow it down. Okay, so he is uh, close enough, certainly. So let's go ahead and put number two on him. Like so. And our red light is on. You can see our red, li red little beacon there is on, so that's good. All right, so next is... the eighth artifact and the light is on beacon light is on just tuck him in here a little bit closer all right so all we need to do now is go to weeping angel commands and then put him near number six and the wormhole should open so let's zoom out here just a little bit 
and number six is right there. All right. So I am super excited. We are opening the gate. I think this is like the third, only the third time I've done this. Or not opening up the gate, opening up the uh, wormhole to over the barrier. And here we go. I'm just going to slowly creep in here. And there it is. There's the wormhole. All right. So again, I'm going to, it should stay open. And I think as long as we're not shooting at these OTAN here, we should be okay. But I'm going to go ahead and take off Oops. I'm going to go ahead and take off the things here. Oh, they are shooting out, so we need to do this quick. Let's take off the system. Trying to do this as quick as possible. I know I'm not doing it too quick, but there's a ton of Zotian going on here. <laughs> Jesus. All right, everybody should be, should be good. There's a ton of Zotian coming out of there. Look at them guys. So that wormhole should stay open. So that wormhole is now permanently open, so we don't need to do anything else like that. So what I'm gonna do here is I'm going to now jump these guys back to a safe area. <clears throat> Excuse me, a safe area. So we're just gonna jump them back here, should be fine. And then our last little ship here, our utility class. We will jump him back here as well. Oh, <laughs> I have to unpilot him. So let's do that. Jump back into Weeping Angel Command, go back to the map, and then jump him in here. Alright, so they should all be safe. We'll just keep them there. They should be safe and nothing will attack them. So, Alright, guys. We are... We have the wormhole to over the barrier. So let's just go jump into the wormhole and see if there's anything good there just right over the... I don't think there is. I think it's just like an empty sector, but uh, let's see what we got. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so our adventure is hailing us again, so let's go, <laughs> let's go ahead and talk to him. You did it. We did it. A dream come true. Now we'll find Avorian and get rich selling it. Yeah, thank you for your help. Thank you for your for your help. This is so amazing. Good luck on your search for Avorian. To you too. Okay, so the deal is here. After you're over the barrier, and if you have hyperspace, let's just go into build mode here. If you have hyperspace core um, built from Avorian, you can then jump pretty much over anything like any barrier, even these barriers here. So you can do any jumps like that. So yeah, 
All right, so I'm going to leave it there, guys. I hope you enjoyed, and if you did, go ahead and give it a thumbs up, and if you want to be notified when there's more, because there will be more exciting adventures over the barrier, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, and I hope everybody stays safe. Bye for now.